We have new developments tonight in the case against the suspect accused of kidnapping a young girl from Moreau Lake State Park in September. Craig Ross Jr. arraigned on nine charges this morning. He pleaded not guilty. News 10 ABC Skyler Eagle was in Saratoga County Court for that arraignment and has more details on the accusations and what comes next. The courtroom today packed with several law enforcement officers and others as the Saratoga County District Attorney's Office charged Craig Ross Jr. with kidnapping, assault, and endangering the welfare of that young girl, among other charges. Mr. Ross, how you answer to indictment number H231-2023V, the nine counts contained therein, the top count being kidnapping in the first degree, the class A1 felony in violation of section 135.25 sub 1 of the penal law, guilty or not guilty. Guilty. Ross pleading not guilty to nine total charges, including the top charge of kidnapping. He's accused of kidnapping a young girl while she was riding her bike not far from her family in Moreau Lake State Park in September. The search for that girl prompting an Amber Alert over the course of two days until police found her inside a trailer on Ross's mother's property. Police tracing a ransom note left at the girl's home to Ross through a fingerprint from a DWI in 1999. The first count of the indictment alleges that he abducted another person and his intent was to compel a third person to pay or deliver money or property as ransom. District Attorney Karen Hagan says the investigation is still ongoing and her priority is bringing justice for this girl and her family. We will do it well, we will do it thoroughly and completely because of the work that has been done and continues to be done by law enforcement to hold this defendant who's committed a heinous, terrible offense against a tender aged victim, we will hold him accountable and responsible. Ross was remanded to Saratoga County Jail without bail. His next court date is set for December 21st. If convicted, he could face consecutive sentences with the top charge facing a maximum sentence of 25 years to life. You can read more details about this case on our website, news10.com. For now, reporting in Boston Spas, either Eagle News 10, ABC.